You're looking good. Welcome to college game day. Yeah, where are we going? Welcome to game day. Welcome to college game day. Here at Schneider Stadium in Waukesha, Wisconsin. Picture day for the Carroll Pioneers. Standing by with junior safety, Billy Krawcheck. Billy, how's camp going? It's going great. You know, it's a grind, you know, with all the meetings, practices. Getting up early for breakfast, staying up late with the meetings. But it's a grind we appreciate, you know, getting out here, coming play football every day. Well, and the media. You the media. You kind yeah, of forgot about day. that. Forgot all about media, media controversy you guys Looking get. forward to it all this time. I didn't know we'd have this nice new... Nice new stand we got out here, so it's nice. You guys got a lot of new stuff going on here, man. I'm, I'm coming back here. I've only been out of here for like two months, and you guys have changed almost half the campus. You know, it stays the same. That bell stays the same, Bill. Bell, bell's never leaving. Anything changing uh, philosophically, or are you guys just kind of going out and attacking every day the same way? You know, we're, we're the same people, but we're a lot stronger. We're a lot faster. You know, we put in a lot, a lot of work this offseason with Coach Hill, uh, designed like each individual program for us. So, like I said, we're a lot faster, we're a lot stronger. We're flying around. Making plays, you know, it's going to be a fun season to watch. Billy, I'm excited to see it, man. Thanks for the time, buddy. No problem. Thank you. Schneider Stadium, Carroll University, Waukesha, Wisconsin. Lucas Lubke, wide receiver for the Pioneers. Lucas, good seeing you again, man. Good seeing you, Bill. So how has the summer been? How's camp been going, treating you? It's been going great. Um, I think what's awesome about camp is we just really get to focus on football, get to be one big family. Um, quite literally, just get, get to be NFL athletes for, for two weeks. You know, it's just nonstop football, so I've been loving it. That's the best part. You dive into it, you get all the free meals. I know that was one of my favorite parts, but then you get the practice, you get the camaraderie, you get the meetings, and then you get out here and you get to practice. Uh, what has been going on between the lines that's been maybe a little bit different between uh, this camp and the camps that you've seen before? Yeah, no, absolutely. Um, with the NCAA doing away with the, uh, with the two days, really just been focusing it every single day. Um, taking that, you know, one and a half to two to three hours to just be out here, um, execute at a high level every single play to make sure that we're ready to go um, when Saturday start. We talked to Colton a little bit about it and Noah, the quarterbacks, and uh, I know from being, you know, on the offensive side of the football, the verbiage that you guys use and being able to transition through plays, the no huddle, all that kind of goes into, you know, being successful. It's one of those things that the between the lines part that people might not be able to see. So how has that been going, not just for you and maybe the returners, but for the young guys as well? Absolutely. Uh, we want to play an up-tempo offense. Uh, we want to speed up the defense, keep it relaxed on ourselves. Um, but really, we just spent a lot of time in the meeting rooms uh, going over our verbiage, making, spur making sure that we're speaking uh, Pioneers, our language here for the offense. So um, we really want to be up-tempo, no huddle. Um, but really, I just think it comes down to spending a lot of time in the meeting room, uh, going over the singles every single day with those young guys to make sure that you know they're ready to rock and roll and they're, they're on a level that, that the returners are on. So you're into, I mean, you're a picture day here now. I mean, the next the first game's like eight days away. You guys are in the midst of this thing. So when you look at it uh, in hindsight, you you came in here on a different different path, you know, as a transfer student. What made Carroll so appealing to you, and why did you ultimately choose to become a member of the Pioneers? Yeah, I love that question. Um, you know, when I was looking around, um, I came from a high school that was a, a phenomenal family atmosphere. And obviously, um, sometimes when you're transferring or even committing to a school, you're not really going to know what you get until you get there. Um, but, you know, I feel like I made a phenomenal decision. The family atmosphere that we have here, the coaching staff, um, I just feel like I can be the best version of myself because of the atmosphere that they provide for us here. Lucas, thanks for the time, man. Appreciate it. Thanks Excited so to much, see you on Bill. the field, buddy. Thanks so much, Bill. Bill Schmidt alongside kicker of the Pioneers, Jr., Griffin Eidelman, you've been around this campus a long time, man. What makes it so special for you? Oh, man. The second I walked onto Carroll, I knew it was the place for me. The people of Carroll University are they're unlike anywhere else. Uh, they care about you. You're not a number. You're a student here, and that's one of the main reasons that I love this place. And one thing that you know you have that's a little bit separate from everybody else uh, on the team is you work in the admissions department. You work... Uh, now, candid here, as people might be able to see you, <laughs> yeah. uh, you might be the one that's giving them a tour when they come around exactly. here in Waukesha. Uh, yeah, I, I'm a tour guide for Carroll University. Uh, I, you know, give tours. I work on campus days. Uh, and that's one of the things I love about uh, being a student worker at Carroll is I get to tell people about my experiences here and get to kind of show them why I love Carroll so much. And why did you choose Carroll, man? Because it does seem like you are very, very passionate about this place. Guys, uh, people that are around, this, you know, the coaches, the alumni, we're all very passionate about it too. But why did you choose Carroll? Uh, I chose Carroll specifically. Uh, I loved Coach K and the entire coaching staff here at Carroll. I really wanted to go to a place where I could do sports but also have a heavy focus on my education. And, and that was a great uh, attribute of Carroll University. Ready to see you guys take on that new field in Lakeland, man. Oh, thank you very much, Bill. Looking forward to it.